Isn't that cool? Look at she's making a doll. Leaving stall because that's all you have left is a couple of scraps. You don't have anything to fill it with, so you put a, a lighter scrap on top and put a face on it, and that's her face and her apron, and that's her dress. Right now, I'm making a button. Buttons. Trying to make a button. Remember those little toys we saw the, over there? They were the little uh, pewter toys? Yeah, we almost That's got a button. That's the same idea. Right? Oh, oh, did you want to see inside? Yeah? Alright, so you're going to have to look quick because I can't take it off for too long. Ready? Right. It's bread. <gasps> Whoa, you see that in there? So what I'm doing is I'm turning it sideways and then I'm going to turn the whole pot oh, when it's cold so that way it heats up evenly. Yeah, yeah. Otherwise you get hot spots and then you get one side of the bread just burnt. So you switch it about every 15 minutes. Cake. And do a little artwork with it, right? <laughs> this here musket is a bit of a bastard, and I mean that with all due respect. It's got an English lock from about 1700. It's got a British barrel that's similar age to the uh, the brown bass. French stock, French banding, and the bayonet is a repurposed kitchen knife. This is a typical uh, musket that an early Revolutionary War militiaman would have had. It was built from pieces and parts that they had left over that may or may not even be functional when he sends it into battle. I've been in trouble all year. Yeah. Yeah. Even Maine, it drove up and couldn't get it. Yep. And with all these little regiments, they're all their officers. So he made them Continental Regiments. That's what we wound up being. And we never had a uniform because there wasn't, with no blue and white coats or anything, we never had those. We had Massachusetts bounty coats. Oh, really? And that was that was the closest thing we ever had. We wore them at the Battle of Long Island, and we wore them when we crossed the Delaware River Christmas night. We never had a uniform. Plus, the more fire you get under it, Faster it'll puff up. And yeah. then I cut it open and I put cheese in it. It's Ooh. like a case of... Surprised you want to put it back to melt it. I know. I think it's hot enough. <laughs>